Well, hey everybody, this is uh, Sean Olson, and I'm going to do uh, also known as Liquid 8 main game, I guess. Uh, but I'm going to do some uh, Anna nade uh, tutorials on uh, like preset nades and a little bit of positioning guide, but uh, mostly on the preset nades. And I'm going to I'm going to break them up by each uh, level and each point and attack and defense. So they're going to, um, some of them might be longer, maybe 15 minutes, but most of them will be pretty short, maybe under five minutes or even less. Um, and then so like, you know, if you're worried or uh, curious about any particular map, you can just uh, go to that particular video and uh, refresh on the nades for that video or for that level or even that chunk of level. Um, so, to get started, uh, I'll show you what I'm going to do here. I'm going to go play, and game browser, I'm going to create a custom game. And then I have a uh, Anna preset nade practice uh, here, uh, which is a preset, and um, I'll show you what it is really quick. It's basically, I went into Heroes, and I believe it's in general, the ability cooldown time is set to 0%, so I can throw nades as quickly as possible. And then, um, my speed, uh, or my vertical speed is set to about 300%. I guess I could set that to 300, it doesn't really matter. Um, so I can jump, and I can jump after the nades when they go, if I have to get over a building or something to see like where they're landing and then um, my movement speed is maxed out here at 300 percent um and then i can you know run really fast after the nades to see, after i throw them i can see exactly where they land so that's kind of my settings that i use to uh find the nade spots um and that's about it I'm going to set this to, we're going to start with Hollywood, and this one is going to be Hollywood attack, uh, by the way, so um, the red team is the attacking team and the blue is the defending team, so here we go, we'll swap to red team and we'll get started. So this is the first one and then subsequent videos after this Welcome I won't go through this um, this stuff. So here we go attacking Hollywood. Um, here we are. Uh, you can go out three doors. One, two, three. Um, sometimes at the beginning here you might be able to get a, a cheeky sleep on a Hanzo or something like hanging out on top of that car. But uh, if you go left, uh, I don't usually go left, but there is one nade here um, that you can pressure. It's kind of a blind nade. You just look up uh, to this tree, um, go right to the top of those leaves, and then just to the little little bit to the left of them, um, so, so you miss the trunk there. Uh, and you can toss that nade, and that thing should land, I believe, right behind point back here. Or, oh, oh yeah, 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 it lands right up here. So, um, you can use that, it's blind, it's a blind nade, you might hit something, you, it's not gonna help too much, but it might give you a little bit of ult charge. Um, what I would usually do is go out this door, actually. Um, so you go out this door, your team is probably gonna go out the front door right here, and you can come out, you can keep them healed over here, and you can kind of look at where the enemy team is. Now if the enemy team, um, if they're trying to get early picks and they're hanging out, like sometimes they hang out like right here and they're trying to, you know, uh, snipe or, you know, Hanzo's on top of the car or playing around this car here. Um, and the healers are kind of like hanging back, like maybe right, right in here. Um, what you can do, a nade for that, so you can come out keeping your team healing, they're having trouble pushing forward a little bit, um, you can go right back here into this corner. You get into that corner, let's see, so to where you don't really move. And here you see kind of like a maybe a C shape um, there, and the, that little corner right there, you aim right at that corner, you throw your nade, 
then you're gonna come up here. It will land like right in front of the car here. So that's kind of a helpful nade to help pressure the enemy team and make them make them maybe back off a little bit. If they're not all forward and say uh, that means they're probably all back, you know, and that sometimes the tank is like hanging here, um, and people are you know back here like shooting, trying to get an angle and get a pick or two. So uh, you can pressure them by hitting this backsplash here. Um, and the way to do that, uh, so you come out, and no one's there, or they're way back there, you know? Uh, so what you can do here is you go back to this corner, right back here. And you can go back here, and there's the Q underneath your um, ult charge meter there at the bottom of the screen. You put that Q right on top of this point. So there's this point right here. You don't zoom for this one. Um, and you put the Q right on top of that. You toss. And that should, that nade should land, you know, right on this backsplash. Like, right there. So that's a pretty nice one. Now moving forward, I think I have eight nades for this. Uh, one, two, that was three. So, um, moving forward, um, if you can take this green car and play around the green car, um, uh, one one you can do is you duck and you get up by this front hood just so you're like kinda like you're still protected because you're ducked if you're here you can get picked but if you're ducked you're pretty safe and you can just aim like right at that line underneath the Goldshire Studios uh, text and then so if you aim kinda like right right in there that'll hit the high ground and you can pressure the high ground um, right over the front hood there. If you push right into this wheel well, um, right there, and then line up with these two pillars, uh, and this B, see the B there? So you line up with the two pillars, you go straight up, you keep going up till you hit the B, and then toss, and that should probably land like right in here. Okay. So it hits right right on the corner. Um, so that'll that'll pressure people for sure too. Um, so that's a good one. If you, if you happen to be holding this car, if you end up you know you this this position's too hard. You got a Genji or a Tracer or something like mucking with you. You can pop over this way and get in this corner. Um, you got your Mega here for health. You're healing your team here. Um, they're not making a push at all. Um, you're keeping them healed, okay? You can actually just go into this corner, and you see the gun uh, below uh, your ammo count, um, the the like Anna UI gun thing. You just put the barrel of that up here on Lucio's finger, so that the sign has Lucio on it up there. Hopefully, they don't change that graphic, um, which they could do but you just aim that barrel right at Lucio's finger, you toss, and that can uh, pressure this kind of same point again. Um, but from a different position. So a lot of this is knowing the nades from the position you find yourself in, um, instead of trying to go to a position. Uh, you know, so you're, you're hitting the same spot from different positions. Next up uh, would be up here. Um, this one I actually, I think I learned this from Gail Adelaide. Uh, you can go stand on this, this guy here, maybe duck in the bush so they don't see you um, from over there. I don't, I don't like the position very much um, because you can get sniped and you're pretty exposed. But um, if, if you know there's a Widow up there and she's giving your team trouble, or, you know, maybe a Torb or something too up there. Uh, what you can do is aim right at the tip of this, and I like to actually aim a little bit higher than the tip and uh, throw. That'll hit right up there, and that'll splash the Widow or the Torb or, you know, whoever's up there. Um, if, you, if you aim right at the tip, I think it splashes right off the front edge, and it might not get them. Um, 
So, anyway, uh, moving forward, your team's moving in. Um, they're all up here. They're trying to. They're trying to get through. Um, what you can do is. Uh, you're hanging out. You should always be with Anna. You always need to be hanging around cover. Um, she's so uh, squishy and uh, doesn't have a lot of defense. And if you miss your sleep dart, you only got one sleep dart. <laughs> and if you miss it, you're dead. So you got to play around cover. She's very posi positioning related or heavy. Um, so anyway, you can you can help pressure here. You're still healing your team, but if you uh, look straight up here. Um, there's this thing, and if you put that Q right on that thing, um, you can throw, and th that will land, you know, right, right here. Um, yeah, there you go. So, but the thing with this one is, it's actually pretty wide open. You can just line that Q up anywhere along here, you know. Uh, kind of going this way, so you know, like if you want it right behind the point here, uh, you throw it here, and that should land, you know, probably right in here somewhere. Uh, let's see. Oh, that that was high ground. Okay, there you go. Well, that that one's high ground. Um, that lands low ground. If you go here or here or here or here, um, it's gonna land, you know, all in this area. So, I mean, those are all viable grenades. Um, on going the other way, uh, you're gonna have to set it up higher if you, if you want to hit like here or here. Uh, you can just you know stand behind that car still, um, and you aim it kind of more up here. Um, I believe above the eye is about your max. Um, so those should land, you know, kind of. So, oh, not even the eye. You gotta be a little bit even. Uh, uh, there's your eye, so the R, like, kind of area. So, and you, that's on the top one here. So, so that one. So we got this. We got this. We got that. Um, so that's a lot of a lot of good nades. Now you're moving through choke. You want to kind of play around this car if you can. And when you're coming through, check your high ground up here. Are there people up there? If there are, if they're they're trying to hold high ground, uh, or like you usually even don't even want to follow people in. If your team's going in straight in here, hold hold maybe in here, maybe even pull back here and try to keep them healed. Um, so if they went high ground, you can help pressure here. I learned this one from ML7. Um, and actually, you can throw the nade through the fence here. But um, you see that you line up that thing. And that's the top edge of this roof if we come over here. See that top edge of that roof? Um, you line that guy up right here. So once you see that, you're lined up, and then you just aim to the, the middle of this roof, um, right through there. You toss, and that'll pressure that high ground really well. So, and then another spot, um, if your team does decide to go backwards, or you decide to flank, um, you know, you're healing people up here, and maybe, maybe somebody's coming, they're trying to poke through this way. If they're getting held, maybe here a little bit. Um, keeping them healed. You go to, th to this box, the very corner here, and if you look up, you see this vent. There's this vent right there. Um, what you can do is you look, you get wedge yourself right into that corner, and you uh, aim right next to that vent. If you're completely next to the vent, it'll uh, land right on the close side of the car on point, so it should land like you know, right in here. There you go. Um, and you can go down about two, uh, two, two of these tiles. You know, um, so you know that's right on that car. Uh, this might be like right on the car, and then this will be uh, on kind of the far side of the car. So let's try that. Let's do. So what did I say? So this was uh, close, close. Uh, medium and far. So 
there's one. So where's two? Okay. Three. So there you go. Like if you go any further, you're gonna hit, you're gonna hit the roof up there. You're not gonna do anything. Uh, and uh, and then you can you know kind of play around uh, this guy. You got your mega here for backup. Um, you could play play back here and try to keep people healed. Um, yeah, always be playing with cover. Always be thinking about cover. You know. So and uh, that's probably about all she wrote on Hollywood Attack A. So, uh, thanks. Well, I'm not paying you for your acting ability. Let's get moving.